Americans, if you are watching this, I would like you to scan this QR code that I created, okay? You see this? Americans, now is the time to support the MASA Act. Okay, now, um, wait, let me, how do I bring it back? Okay, here we go. Um, what is the MASA Act? So, let me share my other thing. If you scan that QR code that I created, it will bring you to um da, 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 da. okay here we go it will bring you to this google doc that i created what is this google doc this google doc is everything you need to know to contact your representative about the masa act so first very quickly Right now, there is a bill that has been introduced to the floor of the House of Representatives. And um, let me find the full name. It is the Masa Amini Human Rights and Security Accountability Act, or Masa Act for short. And this is a bill that is levying sanctions against Khamenei, Raisi, his cabinet, all of these people in very targeted ways. And you can go read through the whole bill if you want, because I included it in this Google Doc. Okay. So all you have to do is find your representative if you don't already know. I include a link in all the instructions you need to find your representative. Now, ideally, you would also find their local office number. If you don't, that's fine. Number two, after you have your representative, you find the phone number of their DC office. Okay. I made it super easy. There's a Google Doc right here that has the contact information for every US representative in the US, okay? No matter what state you're in. Next, you can use this email that is pre-written for you as a script, or you can just use it to send as an email. Call your representative, send them an email. They have the mandate to record this and respond to you, respond to your needs. You're their constituent. And so once again, wait, let me bring back the QR so you have all the information super easy for you to find okay once again let's share this boom scan this QR code and you will have all the information you need to tell your representative to help pass the MASA Act through the House of Representatives then it would go to the Senate Da, da, da. then it would pass Congress. So right now, the big thing is that it is almost entirely Republicans who have so far signed their support for the MASA Act. I believe last time I heard there was only a single Democrat, Gosh. single Democrat that supported the MASA Act. This is reprehensible. And I'm not gonna start talking about NIAC because I will start ranting. Which okay. Democrat? I don't remember off the top of my head. The Iranian community that I have been networking with has personally asked, they could not be more clear that this is the type of action that they want the government to take. They want these sanctions. This goes against popular narratives that makes Democrats very uncomfortable. So <laughs> the, the Iranian community could not be more clear to me and expressing their wishes of pushing for the MASA Act. Yes, that includes sanctions. They want to combat regime affiliated propaganda that has been lobbying on the regime's behalf for decades. This is coming from the community and this is what they are seeking. So please, 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 like I said, all the information is present if you scan this QR code. Email your representative, call your representative at their DC office, at their local office. If you're, if you're on fire, do it once a day. Tell them how you feel. Maybe just go on a rant about how they're not doing enough or what these protests inspire in you, how it affects your life personally. And then tell them that you want them to support the MASA Act, which is, um, let me find the exam, uh, HR 9203. HR 9203. You want them to show their support for HR 9203. Okay. So Americans, this is what you can do. People are asking for what you can do, especially if there are not demonstrations in your area. 
this is easy and it's tangible. And this is what the Iranian community, American, Iranian American community has been asking for. So now's your opportunity. Please go ahead and take advantage of this. I tried to make it as easy as possible. Um, Miriam is saying, how do I scan this if I'm streaming this from my phone? Okay, try to take a screenshot and then you should be able to open it from the screenshot or maybe scan it from a separate device um, after you know the stream is done or pause, whatever, whatever. If you pause and stop to go do this, I will forgive you. <laughs> In fact, I encourage you, but- um, Just yeah, screenshot so can, it. Yeah, screenshot it. You can um, send this to other people. I tried to make this as easy as possible for anyone to do. And um, you know, credit is where credit is due. A lot of this um, information that it, I found in this document, I got from the Iranian Americans that I've been working directly with. So I need to give them credit as well. Um, that being said, please go ahead. This is really effective um, activism, Susie. Amazing oh, work. thank you. I was like on it today. This is what I whipped up. <laughs> you're doing, you're such a great activist. Like this is like, this is the real stuff. This is the real deal. Good job. I'm oh, so thank proud you. of you. I try, you know, like I, I was at a demonstration yesterday. This is what they were talking about. And I was like, I have this platform. Like, let me do this. Um, it's not that hard. I want to get the word out to as many people as possible. Yeah. Oh, Marion, thank you. Um, uh, oh, Killa's saying that's actually a great doc. Well, thank you. I tried my best. You can now get the sexiest blasphemous art ever known to mankind for free. Too sexy to show most of it here on YouTube. We draw Muhammad, Hindu goddesses, sexy hijabi art, Jesus, Mother Mary, Japanese God, Greek gods, and much, much more. Click on the link below where it says get our free blasphemous art.